Yeah, the Wingate is, is the first book of the School of Ministry series. Um, so it really kind of hashes out to see of who's the main character, his his flight in life, and how he, his parents were murdered by the age of six, and he was a foster child going from home to home. Always felt like he, he, he was looking for his place in life, and he had gifts he can see. Uh, he can see demons if he closed his eyes, um, if they were around. He can feel them uh, in his body. He could just feel their presence and sense them being there. And he just didn't know what that meant. Didn't know if anybody else had the same uh, thing, same gift or not. And he was uh, early on in the book, first chapter. I kind of throw everybody right into the story from the beginning. Uh, by the second chapter, you really kind of see his journey. Uh, he meets an old um, love of his life named Stephanie. They kind of meet back up after years. He's 18 years old. She had graduated from high school before he did, got married, and then he met her again in Atlanta. And uh, over lunch, uh, he finds out that she's getting divorced. And this is like his big moment that maybe professes love to her and says he wants to be with her. So he goes to meet her the next day at her hotel room. And uh, when she when he gets there, everything's in shambles. I mean, all the furniture's turned over, clothes are uh, strewn across the floor in the bed, and then he gets kidnapped. Um, so then the second chapter opens up with you really experiencing what he's going through being kidnapped and basically the school of ministry said that they came in and they rescued him before he really got uh, hurt by whoever had gotten to Stephanie and really what they do is they're trying to recruit him because they know he has gifts they've been watching him for a while and they really just want to kind of use him as part of their team uh, to hunt down evil and defend the weak and uh, they say that if he does join them, then they will be more than happy to help him look for Stephanie. So there's a lot of, you know, does he trust him? Who is this group? Is this the truth? But at the end of the day, he's never been a part of something that's big. So he does have a longing to do that, but also he wants to find Stephanie. So if he can use it to his advantage, at least skate it for a while, get Stephanie and get out of there, that's kind of where he'd like to go. So 